is the jackal permitted to make a call? To whom? Why, the brusque lady of justice should be present prior to answering any and all questions. Listen, I'm not here as a cop. I'm here as a brother who's afraid for his sister. Uh, then why did the law-abiding one find it necessary to flash his credentials upon entering? Well, just to make sure you'd let us in. So, where's Lulu? Well, sadly, the jackal's not privy to the mock prince's chosen path of flight with his helpless we, we, hostage. We know the truth. Uh, to what truth would the blonde one's brooding brother be referring? You don't have to cover for Lulu. We know that she brought the gun into the station. Did you help her plan the escape? Why, well, uh, the, the blonde one gave no indication that she was planning anything, much less than springing Johnny, as it were, from the hallowed halls of the PCPD. <laughs> sure she didn't mention anything to you? The only person Fair Lulu confides in anymore is the Son of Darkness. Have any charges been brought against Jason Morgan? Well, then when is he getting released? You can't keep him in lockup forever. You know what? Never mind. I'll take it up with the commissioner. What does my father want now? Your father's far too busy screaming at my father to use me as his carrier pigeon. Matt? Yeah? No, I came here all by my own. Why is that? Well, because I think I can be extremely helpful to you. Oh, really? Well, I'll tell you something. The only help that I'm interested in is getting my brother out of this mess. That's exactly what I plan to do. I appreciate that you're letting me do this. I'm sure we'll all sleep better knowing this guy's off the street. Yes. In three, two, one. I'm here with Special Prosecutor Scott Baldwin, whose son, Logan Hayes, was brutally murdered on July 8th and dumped in front of a clinic in the warehouse district. The prime suspect, John Zakara, managed to escape police custody late last night. Can you tell me more about that, Mr. Baldwin? Johnny Zakara broke out of jail with the help of his girlfriend, Lulu Spencer. She smuggled a gun into the police station and pretended to be held hostage. She and Johnny are armed and dangerous and on the run. Can you call the tower in Montreal? I want to make sure that there are no delays. I have to get to this meeting on time. Uh, don't let the hose out. Check in. How, how did you... What, 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 what are you doing, Carly? You know what? I think it's so sweet that you keep my favorite champagne stocked on the jet. Which nice? No, I, 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 I can't have any. I, I have to have a clear head for this meeting. Well, you know what? At least we get to spend some time together. Flying is like time out of time. You know, no one to bother us. No crisis we have to solve. No one gets to leave even if they want to. Just get to focus on each other. Yeah, if you want to ignore our problems, which I just can't right now. Okay, then tell me your problems, and I will do whatever I can to solve them. Okay, well, you don't lean on me when you're hurting. And I know that there's always a valid reason, but in the end, I still feel shut out. And then I bury myself in my work, which requires me to, uh, you know, work with Kate sometimes. That upsets you, you get all bent out of shape, and uh, then before you know it, two people that never want to fight are always fighting. Now. Because you haven't listened to a word I said. I heard what you said. I just don't agree with all of it. Right. Because the thing that you're missing is with everything we've done wrong, it doesn't go away. Everything we've done right. We have life together. Day in and day out. We've shared memories and moments. You want to get better? No, I want us to get better. Or I want us to let go. I'm not letting go.